So you say you save yourself from adultery by masturbating. You save yourself from adultery. It is good that pounds, it is good pounds. that you see Mutamar is and adultery. And it is besides, good besides, that you see Mutamar is adultery. Besides, that will teach you not to divorce your woman because you already have paid the dowry, so you don't have to do your socks, do your food, and masturbate. So thank you for identifying <laughs> Muta marriage as adultery. That's absolutely fine. Um, just that action which you are thinking to do is not allowed in Islam. Okay. But that, that's not. I'm not going to yeah, discuss I'm those issues. About but but I just want to. Women, I just want to bring up something women, to your attention. I don't know about the women how they think because they are different. We are different from each other. The woman. If she feels that she loves her husband after she got divorced, she wants to come back to him, it's up to her. Let's now say, take one verse from the Bible and see how the Bible treats women. Uh, geometry 124. <laughs> yeah, the, 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 yeah, 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 but I, yeah, I will. I, that's Say it again. Deuteronomy. 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 Whatever you said. 124. All right. It says. Well, well, 124. What it says. Yeah. If a man, if a man right. marry a woman yeah. and she didn't please him sexually and he find her uh, smell bad, he can divorce her and kick her out of his house. All right, let's check. If she got married again, another man, and he find her not sexually attractive and smelly, that filthy, not and clean, I, according to him, he can kick her off his house again, and she get, she can go away. And Islam, if I am married to somebody, I cannot kick her from my house because it's her house, and I have to go. And I have to go out because Quran states that it's her house, not mine. Open it so, and read it. Uh, can I just point out something? Your reference is wrong. Give me the right reference. But the issue is, I want to. I try your to reference, find it. Yeah, I go, and get, find. go and get your Bible. The issue is. It is amazing how Muslim man, without any shame, is quite happy for his wife to marry with a stranger, actually not marry, have a sex with a stranger in the intention of coming back. And he was even able to make fun of it. I think it is very, very bad. It is very, very bad. Give me the right reference here. here. So now we identified Islam is messed up. Which direction you go, it is all messed up. Before we move to that one, let me give you some. Let me tell you how does marriage work in Christian scripture. All right. Give full attention, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I'm listening. Okay, because I will ask you to repeat what I said. All right. Okay. I will ask you to repeat what I said. So here is the marriage in Christian scripture. We look at the marriage because we have a God who is identified as Triune God. Okay? Triune God, yeah. God the Father, His love, killer, he is. As, as the Son of God, He lays down His life on the cross for humanity. He offers Himself to humanity. Huh. He proposes to humanity those who turn away from their sin and then accept what Lord Jesus Christ did on the cross for them. He proposes them. We see that as a biblical marriage. Jesus is our bridegroom. Is that correct? Br uh, groom, yeah, he bride. The groom. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's the groom. He's the groom. Yeah. groom. And we are identified as the bride who is the church. As we look at the scripture, yeah. Christian scripture doesn't tell us in the beginning when God created Adam and Eve, full attention, Yaya, not listening, listening. Adam and Steve, not Adam and baby Aisha, 
Nice. Not Adam and Aisha and Sophia and Zainab and all others. No, I it have is... 12 wives. <laughs> no, I have 12 wives here. I it's, it's Adam and Eve. I left the evidence about the me, uh, Aisha's let me age. Let and me finish. You let have me it, finish. You have it on your UCCI and you have it on Soko no, Film. No, let, let I always finish. give evidence and references and the sources as well. Ah, right. So God did not create yeah. Adam and Eve. Oh, sorry, Adam and Eve. Adam and Steve. Adam and Steve. Adam and Steve. No, but Adam, Adam and Eve. Adam and Aisha and Zainab and Sophia and then Hafsa and Sauda. God, God created Adam and Eve who were capable to look after God's creation. And, war booty and war booty. That their marriage, it is amazing. Adam sees this woman, yeah. and then we get to see first love story, first poem. I will, I will, I will, I will, I will. First poem, man is giving to woman. Yeah, yeah. Full ears, please, full ears, and if it is necessary, full eyes. Put them, put it on, put it on, put it on. Okay, see you without the glasses. Only for reading, I need and marriage took place between Adam and Eve was until death set them apart. Okay? Okay. So uh, that is our principle comes. Man and woman marries, marriage is very hard. But when you focus your eyes, when you gaze your heart upon Christ, Lord Jesus, Jesus all transforms that marriage and we don't get divorce. No. So, therefore, what something called... What a pity. Is that what you see? It's a, it's a pity we, because... We see, we see how it is, how it is serious uh, and important. How look at your yeah, 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 I look didn't... Look at how I didn't, single mom. I didn't look at divorce. In. There's no divorce in Christianity, uh, yeah. There's adultery in Christianity. Yep. Sorry, I, I as, respond uh, as to you your brother there. As you cannot divorce your wife because you gazed your eyes on someone else, as you can't uh, go and sleep around in Christian scripture, all you have to do is love your wife as Christ loved the church. He gave his self for the church. That's the biblical marriage. So, what was your reference, Yahya? Uh, Geometry, uh, go on 24 1. But whatever uh, the name is, I, I cannot pronounce it. I cannot pronounce it, man. D E U. Practice, practice, make it perfect. It's fine. My, it's fine. My, my, mine is not, my English is not very good as well. It's fine. 25? Sorry, 25? 24, let me read it, please. No, give me the reference. I'm, uh, uh, 24, uh, uh, from let one? me read it, please. From, from verse 1 to what? Uh, yeah, uh, from, from here to here. From verse 1 to... From here to here. 1 to 5. Yeah. Okay. Listen, listen, please, wait, wait. This is how your Bible teach when you want to divorce a woman, how you treat her. Okay? Carry on. Not when you want... No. Just a correction. Yeah, correction. Not when you want. When? When you want to divorce. When everything go wrong and there is divorce to come through. Please. Can you rephrase there that again? There is no divorce. Uh, when, when your heart is hardened, when your you heart... focused your gaze on something else. Okay. And you decided to go against the will of God. Okay. God gives one of those laws yeah. in the Old Testament. Okay. I read it to you. Okay. Okay. Moses. Uh, Moses gives law. God gives law to the Moses. If a man marries a woman who becomes displeasing to him because he finds something indecent about her and he writes her a certificate of divorce, gives it to her and sends her from his house. From his? From his house. So you kick her I have out. A, just a moment. Oh, sorry, I have, I'll, I'll sorry, I, I'm sorry. And if, after she leaves his house, she becomes the wife of another man, and the second husband dislikes her, 
and writes her a certificate of divorce, gives it to her and sends her from his house. And if he dies, then the first husband who divorced her is not allowed to marry her. Not, not allowed to marry her again after she has been defiled. That would be the te detestable? Detestable. 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 detestable in the eyes of the Lord. Detestable. Do not bring sin upon the land of the Lord your God is giving you as an inheritance. If a man has recently married, I haven't finished it. I, I said that, only. That, that's what you picked. Uh, I'm going to read the whole okay. chapter. Yes, the whole chapter now. Okay. If a man has recently married, oh, before I move to the verse 5, let me just summarize what I read in case your eyes were gazing on something else you didn't listen. Yeah, yeah. Can, can, so, can I comment on your reading? No, 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 no I, will give you, I will give you time. I'm going to make sure you She's understood very it. Kind. Thank you very much. So, Okay. As Yahya brought up this verse, can I just get everyone's attention? Allah steps in in 7th century, Muhammad steps in in 7th century, and then goes against the law of Moses, because the very passage I read, it says, actually, you can't go back to your first husband. It's not that simple. Versus what Muhammad says, it's very simple. Five minute sex will salt it out. So verse 5. Did you get that part here? Uh, carry okay. on, carry on. I don't want to interrupt because I'm if very, a man... very respectable man. Wow. <laughs> Can we see your respectable face? Is that your respectable face? This That's is my face. I'm not going to put uh, <laughs> 300 <laughs> faces in one second. That's the only face you got. That's right. But you guys had to be It was nice. If a man has recently married, he, he must not be sent to the war or have any other duty laid on him. For one year, he has to be free to stay at home and bring happiness to the wife he has married. You married, take your marriage seriously. Say you can't go to, you can't go around, you can't go to, you can't go to war. Your duty is, as a husband and wife, make sure... <laughs> Your duty as a husband and wife, to get to know each other, enjoy each other's company. For one year, Bring not happiness. Not three seconds or not three minutes, 25 yeah, pounds. 25 okay? pounds, uh, This is before, <laughs> if you have to go to war, you can't go to war because you just married, you've got one year as kind of as to get to know each other. Yeah, to have a baby. Do not take a pair of mild milestones, not even an upper one, as a security for a debt, because that would be taking man's livelihood as a security. If a man is caught kidnapping one of his brother Israelites and treats him as the slaves or sells him, the kidnapper must die. You must purge the evil from among you. Um, I guess it's enough till here. Uh, let me comment uh, a little bit on... Uh, so the context of that is what happened? The context is... May I have the pleasure? That's may I have the blessing? Blessing of holding my book. My book doesn't give you blessing. It Lord might, Jesus might will do, give you blessing when you, you kneel know, down you on him. To so what we see in the first one is yeah. actually, I'm a bit disappointed why it came out, but we will we will hear again why it came out. While in the Quran, when you are divorced from first husband, you go and have sex for five minutes with someone else, he divorces you, and then you come back to your first husband, Versus in the law of Moses, actually that doesn't work like that. You can't do that. You can if you divorced, your hardness is hardened. You are divorced. You can't go back to your first husband. Even if your husband, your husband is dead, still you can't go back to your first husband because what is marriage is? Shall I bring my my Bible? If Please you want? do bring your Bible. Yeah.
You don't have to hold that. You are gonna all arm is gonna hurt. Yeah, I'm swapping arm, so it doesn't oh, hurt so much. Sorry. Oh, I had to. It's back. So why are you bringing up a verse for me, which simply screams out, Allah is false god, Muhammad is false prophet, Islam is false religion, and then contra detestable. The bit we, uh, you can't. So if you're, it, yeah, it says. I would like to read it. I would like to read it. I would like. If a man marry a woman who become displeasing to him, what does that mean? Displeasing to him? That means she is not pleasing him and bad. No, 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 no. Where does it say that? Excuse me. Excuse me. Where does it say that, Yahya? Do not ever force your interpretation into my scripture. Okay. It doesn't say that. Okay. Let, let, let Marriage carry on. is hard. Let carry on. They are not getting on well. Okay. It, this it, it, it has this, nothing okay. about their sexual okay, okay. life. Okay. Okay. This Please be honest. Okay. Okay. I, I'm going to be honest. With your honest glasses. Okay. With my honest. Try it. Uh, can become displeasing to him because he's uh, given the cause here yeah. because he find something and decent about her. Yeah. So why she has a wheelie? Are you gonna still continue with her? I'm. I'm I have uh, the no, conversation no, no, with with uh, Sorry, with she, what is she, If she's got the wheelie. <laughs> If, if, if that person is a transsexual. So I, I yes. Uh, so uh, so, uh, so, okay. so uh, you this, see, this is what I'm saying. Okay. If this she's is, got a growth <laughs> on her pussy, you know, whatever, you know. Uh, uh, please, please. Okay. Uh, let me, on, Mr. Bean. So, uh, if her husband finds something indecent about her, yeah. give you me explain an example. It, you explain it the way you like. I'll, yeah. I'll give you an no, example. No, 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 I'll give you an Just example. Let me, let me carry on. I, I, I will let you to carry on. Okay. But when you butcher my scripture, I <laughs> feel I'm <laughs> obligated yeah. to but, step in okay. and then help you to put your glasses on okay. and keep them on. Okay. So, this is his an example. Okay. Okay. Brother married with a woman. Yeah. In three months into their marriage. Yeah. Okay. He is feeling, actually, her heart is not beating for him. He is feeling, no, actually, even though we know God's law, we have to marry until the end of our life, it's not going well. Marriage is not going well. It is not about, oh, she's got spots on her face. It is not about... She's bad in bed. Yeah, it is not about, like, she's... She's not like nice woman, all, the, all those kind of things. It is, if they are hot, yeah, it's not like she doesn't have six packs or those kind of things. So, the indecent, the indecent according to you, not spot on her face, but harden in her heart. So, if he feels that she have hardened her heart, she doesn't love me. She doesn't love me. So, he can kick her out of his house. Yeah. Not kick out. It doesn't say kick out. Okay, carry on. You, the, you, read, read the verse, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Sends About her, her and from his house. So I am divorcing you. Where you go? You go to your family's house. It yeah, is very you, similar in Islam. Yeah, Why do you send have a her, problem? Send her of his house. Yeah. That means he kick her out of his house. That kick means out? The house. No, kick out is like this, okay? Send her. No, just let, let's do the kick out, okay? okay. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I can't touch you. Um... You can touch me. You, brother, can, you can kick me if you want. Bro sorry. <laughs> brother. So this is kicking oh, yeah. out him from yeah. my house. Go. Okay? And then take your shoes with you. Okay. Sorry, brother. So, so oh, this okay. is this is sending back. Okay. Yahya, leave my house now. So according See the to, difference? Okay. I pushed okay. him, I kicked him out, I locked the door, okay. I threw his shoes with him, and then so, then I am sending you back to your, back to your house. Okay. I'm saying leave my house now. Okay. Okay. So goodbye. I, I, and okay. I'll, I'll give okay. you thank you card if okay. you are British. Okay. Uh, okay. If I agree with you, that means 
if I uh, I, I defer this woman. No, I just identified I you. Send Put her my home. scripture now. Come back uh, to the scripture. Okay. No, no. Wait. Let me explain. Sure. So he sent her out of his house. That me he sent her to her to her family's house to her family. So he are sending her from his house. So the house they are sharing together is not her house. It's only his house. So according to who? According to your Bible. No, no. How is it in Islam? How does it in Islam work? In Islam, she owns the house. She and does he own the house. Ah, she owns the house. Because according oh, well, to Quran, okay, let, let's, according I will to Quran, question that. According to Quran, so, so the man who have to leave the house and leave his his wife and leave his family and he need to find another let, house. Let me respond. And he, well, let me explain. If he married another woman, he need to provide her with another house on his because he's the man is the, the one who's responsible for the women. This is what we said. The men have advantage over women. And let now, me let's let, let me just make a point. Respond. No, no, I'm going to okay, make respond, a point. Respond. I think it, it will be helpful respond, for respond. you to see the things in the context. Okay, respond. In John chapter 14, Jesus is talking about Jesus is going to go and prepare room for us. We are not talking about Jesus. I am giving. Talking, you, yeah, yeah, we are listen. not talking about oh, Jesus. Yeah, yeah, why yeah, why are you bringing Jesus into the formula? Jesus, uh, Jesus has nothing to do with a man divorce his woman. Has everything to do with this. Now I'm going to make my point. Just patience. patience. Put your patience glasses I'm on. I'm very sorry. I'm very Put sorry. your patience glasses on. So, when men married in the Israelites, okay? So you already live with your family. You don't go to, let's say this is like first century Israelites. You don't go or let's say 14,000 BC Israelites. You don't move from this land to Turkey to bring your wife to Turkey. It doesn't work like that. Woman comes into your house which you are specially building her, you are making room for her where she's coming to share life with you. So when you divorce her... You kick her out. You send her home, yeah. Send her home. Thank yeah, you. send so her home. Send her back to her family. Yeah. That's how it works. That's how it works even in the time of Jesus. Okay, that's the, how the setting is. Okay. I am sorry that you think as a Muslim man, Islam allows you to build lots of houses for all the vibes you are getting. I just wanted to point out, small point out, Mohammed failed to do that, but for all of his 12 vibes. But anyway, continue. Let's go back to the scripture. So now continue with verse two. Did we yeah, finish the verse one? Let, let me go, hey. And, so, and is after she leave his house, so she went to her home, she became she gets so, married with another she, man. Yeah, a wife for another man. Yeah. So this is the second marriage for the same woman. Yeah. And her second husband divorces her. Dislike her. I don't why he dislike her and uh, uh, why he marry her if he dislike her, and <laughs> and uh, write her a certificate of divorce. Okay, I think I'm expert on this. Let me respond. Okay, you respond. So, you married with someone, okay? I looked at him. He's very nice uh, guy. My heart, my eyes are now like pumping as a heart. Okay. Yeah, heart. Yeah. I love him. Yeah. I, in this stage, I am not. I am not concerned. I am not concerned if he is kind, if he is godly man. Yeah. What kind of church he is attending? Yeah. How is his uh, Bible readings? How yeah. is his scripture knowledge? If does he does he love God with all of his heart? Yeah. Does he love fellow brothers and sisters all of his heart? Like does Muslim. he love <laughs> neighbors as well as he loves like himself? Muslim, like me. So I am not thinking about these things. All I am so I am, soon after I see him, my eyes my eyes are not. <laughs> Pumping my eyes, my eyes, yeah, her eyes, my her eyes, 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 eyes yeah. are Listen carefully pumping, things. pumping <laughs> like heart. Okay. I don't, I didn't think about his relationship with God. I didn't think about his relationship with the church. I didn't think about his relationship 
with the world. And then I'm saying, let's marry. You are just the man God made for me. We marry within two months, not even in two months, first week. What I notice is, uh oh, my husband is not reading the Bible. My husband is not loving God with all of his heart, with all of his soul, with all of his mind. So what I do, I dislike you now. This is just example of 21st century. This dislike is not again, she has a spot. This dislike is not how they have sex, has nothing to do with that. Now, as they get to know each other, their hearts is already hardened while scripture says in the beginning. Actually, so what you would do with him if he, you find that he's not the way you like? In, in this story, yes. you divorce him. So that's just so an example. That's just an example of example, dislike. Yeah. But so in Christian scripture, yeah. If he is my husband, yeah, well, I had to do my homework before I marry him. Ah, okay. So he has to like love yeah. God. If you didn't love God before we married, You're not now gonna it's get time married, for so. you to start loving God. Uh, if if he if he was now it is time. If, uh, if he was yeah, yeah. Okay. now he needs to start loving God. Okay. He needs to start loving the church. Okay. He needs to start loving the neighbor okay. because I cannot divorce him. Okay. I love if, God and I know God's heart doesn't want me to get okay, divorced. Question, so we make marriage question. work. How do we make marriage work? Yeah. Woman makes man yeah. to make man to think the things he likes doing. Reading okay. the Bible, loving God, and then you start now. Okay. That's some, just an example. Uh, okay. uh, your example. So that's the example if, of... Uh, for example, if for example, if he was the way you like. And then he become atheist and he doesn't want, or he become Muslim. That you have has to nothing divorce to do with the passage. No, okay. All I did was I give you an example yeah, the from passage, the passage that when the passage, he disliked her. That's another okay, example. The, okay. How can they be dislike one okay. another? The In passage, the beginning, they did not do homework okay. about the one another. The passage it doesn't talk about the women sending her husband out, but it talk about the men sending her. Uh, her her uh, wife out and even if she get married again from another man the other man he's allowed to send her to her family so, so it, it why is very she, good it is very uh, good and you the are butchering time, and now the go back time, with me go back with me verse 2 and then let's continue to read it from verse 2 yeah here you, you, you read it, you read it. I read it I, already. I read it and then I'll give you time uh, to comment. And the women, women, if she get married twice, she is uh, defiled for the land. Even she become like very filthy and according to this state, what does that mean? Destable? Uh, Destable. What does that mean? Destable in English? Detestable. Yeah, what does that mean? Not this, good in the eyes uh, of God. Something, something what? Not something good, good in the eye, eyes of God. You yeah. find out so so yeah. if, a, if a woman yeah. get divorced twice from two men, she become uh, even filthy for the land and even God, he hate her. This is your Bible. Let, let me respond. You just butcher the scripture again. I'm not butchering. You I'm, did. God doesn't I, I say God hates anything. her. So now let me continue to read it. Now, first what we saw is, first, First thing, I'll just let me summarize again. This passage proves Muhammad is false prophet, Islam is false religion, Muhammad is false book, because Surah 2, 230 goes against this. Okay, that's first point. Second point is we made already. Okay, she bring Quran into Second this, uh, point and Muhammad we... into this, I don't understand. Because the prophet, he didn't yeah, divorce yeah. only for, of his wife. He have he uh, 11 wives. He used to go and visit everyone. It, every one of them have At one night mind. for herself. He sleep with them uh, and sleep with uh, them, and sleep with them, yeah. with them and sleep with them and sleep with them and fondle them and fondle them and I had a bath with them while they were having their uh, periods. But uh, I'm not uh, talking uh, about uh, that. Yeah. So now, uh, carry on, carry on. Now we identified first two verses. You intentionally misrepresented my scripture. I am moving to the third verse, okay? okay really Actually, we did the third verse. Third verse okay. was, and her second husband dislikes her and write her a certificate of divorce. 
gives it to her and sends her from his house. Or if he dies, okay, I got divorced or my husband died. All right. What does it say? Listen this very carefully because this is the part screams out, like seriously screams out, Leave how Islam. false prophet Muhammad is, <laughs> how false God Allah is, and how you've got to get on your kneel, on your Please. knees, and say Jesus is Lord. Listen very carefully. It's not that the law of listen, Jesus when he was God the Father carefully. only. Is that, no, no, my question. Isn't that the law of God, of Moses, who sent it to the Israeli? Listen now, listen no, now. No, no. Then her first God husband, law. who divorced her, if, is not allowed to marry her again after she has been defiled. Her first husband cannot marry with her. Even though her husband is dead now. Okay. Why? Because marriage doesn't work like that, Yahya. If her husband she is can't dead, go. Cannot marry her. First husband. If her husband is dead, he cannot marry her again. We are talking, she just said. If, if her, her no, current husband, husband is dead, died, current he husband. cannot. Current husband died. She can't go back to the first husband because she has been defiled. Why? That would that would be detestable in the eyes of the Lord. Do not bring sin upon the land of the Lord. So marriage is the sin. Your God is given to you as inheritance. So marriage this is the is, sin. Let, 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 let me let me let, yeah, let yeah. me finish your yeah, here. Finish, finish. While while Israelites are getting into the land which God promised them, which was supposed to be for 11 days, but they being unfaithful to God, that took 40 days. As they are getting ready for the promised land, God is telling you, you will see people who are just sleep, getting married, getting married, getting married, and then they might be going back to their first husband. Don't be like them. Don't do it. Because that does not please me. That's all it says. Now, since we identified, the verse which you brought confirms Islam is false religion, Muhammad is false prophet, Quran is false book, all of those things, Yahya. How does it make you feel knowing your prophet, your beloved prophet, simply not only went to revelation Ag um, went against the revelation which God given to him, given to the prophets, but also went against the law of Moses. Does it break your heart or does it make your heart to jump out of joy? Can I respond to that? Yeah. Sure, yes. I'd love to hear about your heart. <laughs> uh, that brings us to the way your God come to being. We open come Matthew. To be, come to be what? Come to being. Being, okay. Be, be. Uh, we open Matthew. We go to. Uh, 18, 19, 20. Matthew 1, 18. verse number 18. And we go down. His mother, Mary, was, was pledged to be married to Joseph. But before they came together, the righteous man and did not want to expose her in public. Uh, and pub to public disgrace, he had a mind to divorce her quietly. So your your God, when he want to beget himself, why could, couldn't he find somebody not to be pledged uh, to be married to Joseph or Moses or uh, uh, or uh, or Anton or uh, or Tony or somebody else? Why didn't your Father, the Holy Spirit, find somebody not to be pledged to someone to get to beget himself out of. And according to you, if uh, according to the teaching of Jesus, if a divorcee woman she get married, she's committing adultery, and your own God, he's overshadowing somebody who pledged to be married to Joseph. How he allow himself to overshadow her to beget himself? 
let me respond to that. Respond. Just, just a quick confirmation. Yeah. As a Christian, I don't believe Father is the Holy Spirit, okay? Father and Holy Spirit are two different persons fair in enough. Godhead. Just fair please, enough, please enough. don't make that such a mistake. Yeah, yeah, now, I, we notice... Because I don't have the Holy my Spirit question, and me. I'm not no, Christian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't have don't the Holy Spirit. Don't give excuse, man with excuse. On the I day of judgment, the, the those Spirit excuses will me. are not going to help you in any form, in any shape, in any second. Okay, so, you now, respond, you now. respond. So my question was very simple. Have you noticed that no answer to my question? Nothing. My question was, how does it make you feel <laughs> knowing your prophet went against the revelation of God Plus, went against the law of Moses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he forced people to practice that. That's disgusting. I think Yahya doesn't even have any thoughts on that. That's very heartbreaking. Because but, the prophet but, had, but, had now, Sharia law. But, the prophet wasn't a Jew. But and now, he let Sharia me. Law. No, no, that I'm doesn't answering you. work with me, Yahya. Reason, you can't, that doesn't work with me now because Surah 381. Yeah. He came to confirm yep. everything prophets, <laughs> prophets thought. Yep. He came to confirm that. Yep. Why yep. why he failed to confirm because, Deuteronomy part? Because Sharia but, law anyway. came to Gentiles, Sharia Spartan, law. not to the Jew. Uh, not to the Jew. What a, what a slave because explanation. The you need Jew, to work on that. The Jew, you they are going to mess up? Sick, no. I will, I will uh, give sorry, you time. I will give you time sorry. to work on your answer because that okay. answer is going to butcher okay. you. Okay? Okay. okay. So, sorry. now, let me let me join with Yahya. Batteries going. Okay. Batteries. Just, just give me a second. No, carry on, carry on. Oh, okay. So, let me... Let me just express what is Yahya is concerned. All right. Yahya is not concerned about <laughs> King of Kings, Lord of Lords, Eternal Word of God. Lord Jesus Christ steps into the world to make salvation possible for humanity. Yahya doesn't con concern about that. All Yahya says Yahya is concerned is he concerns for Joseph. Ah. He concerns for Joseph because Mary was pledged to marry with Joseph. No, because Mary is having a baby, Joseph is going to divorce her. That's Yahya's concern. Okay. But I have better concern and bigger concern for you. Yeah. <laughs> the, the one who made universe, the stars, he knows them by name. The one who, like the power of his word, holds every cell in perfect form. That one steps into the world in the intention, I love you so much, I concern for you, I care for you, and I want you to spend your eternity with me. And this only can be possible if I become truly man, truly God, end up in this broken world without running shoes, without iPhone, without internet. Can you imagine? No. God lived when there was no internet. God lived, God lived among <laughs> us TV. when there was no TV. God lived among us when there was no Indian curry. God lived among us when there was no falafel. Poor God. There was no McDonald's as well. Yet he chose to step he into the world. The McDonald's. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, sorry. Yet he chose to step into the world because the one, we don't deserve it. Whatever we do, Whatever we want to do, we will never deserve it. But he loves us so much. He just pours his love down on us, again on us, again on us, pours his grace upon us, and he's willing to live in those conditions as truly God-man. And not only living in those conditions, he goes upon that cross, gives his life for humanity, so that we can 
spend our eternity in the bosom of the Father. That's what Lord Jesus does. But all your concern is, well, wow, engagement between Mary and Joseph is shaking up because God chose strong people. They were already engaged. Isaiah chapter 7 Can I gives us the reason, gives us the reason. Therefore, the Lord himself will give you a sign. The virgin will be with a child and he will, and will give birth to a son and will be, we will call him Emmanuel, God with us. And we get to hear about that child. Okay, listen this very carefully. That child, okay, that child is, will come in the times, then they will look towards the earth and see only distress and darkness and fearful gloom. And they will thirst into utter darkness. Yet, Lord is going to appear. God, man from this virgin woman, will enter the, enter the world. And it says, yeah, yeah, listen this very carefully. For to us, child is born, to us, son is given, and government will be on his shol sol shoulders, 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 and he will be called Wonderful Counselor. Mighty God, everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. And then it goes on and goes on. And then it says, yeah, yeah. The increase of this government and government and peace, there will be no end. He will reign on the David's throne and over his kingdom, establishing and upholding it with justice and righteousness. From that time on and forever, the zeal of Lord Almighty will accomplish this. And in that darkness, when people intentionally running away from the light, I don't know why Lord chose Mary, as I don't know why God chose me and decided to give his life for me. But God did that for humanity. And amazing thing is, Mary, mother of Jesus. Mother said, of God. Mother of God, yeah. yeah. Church, church calls her, her mother of God. Mother of God, man. Mother of God, yeah. Faithfully accepts the plan of God and says, yes, if you thought in this broken world, if you thought in this broken world, where everyone is hunting for truth, where everyone is hunting for peace, if you thought I can take part, it is just privilege for me that I am happy to have Lord Jesus in my tummy. And nine months after that, Mary, mother of Jesus, Give. My darling. Wait, wait. wait, wait, wait. Okay. Don't call my cameraman your wait, wait, wait. darling. But all of you are my darling. All of you, my friend. All of you, brother, my brother. Brother, don't be darling to a man. Like a... I feel there is a danger. Darling, and, 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 as, as a brother that... and humanity, I'm not. Is I'm not. Like the voice I'm married. You know, I'm not... married. I'm married. I, I don't uh, follow uh, desire for men. <laughs> anyway. Yes. Wait, anyway. Wait. What you, what you what you have said okay, make it that the divorcee woman yeah. divorcee woman is committed adultery while your God chose Mary to share to share Joseph with his children. So God chose Mary chose Mary to beget himself and one as she becomes the mother of God, then the same woman the same woman Mary, she married Joseph and have brother and sister w w w for the man God Jesus. So he have a brother and law with God. 
while why she talk about the prophet muhammad prophet muhammad after his death none of his 11 wife was allowed to marry and sleep with other people while your god i don't find him have any dignity that he begat himself from a woman he allow a man to sleep with her and get brother and sister for the man god this is i find offensive and degrading for god second your god to come to this life to this life he couldn't find a woman who are virgin and still after she beget him is still single but now she need uh, joseph who was commanded in a vision according to uh, the angel of the lord to keep his mouth shut and to be to to because his intention joseph was to divorce her but he didn't want to expose her and he wanted didn't want couldn't divorce her because of the angel and the vision told him shut your mouth and keep it on and keep this woman because she married she is with uh, she have the holy spirit have overshadow her and he's begetting himself i don't know which the father is the father of jesus or the holy spirit is the father of jesus or jesus is the father of himself to be honest with uh, this trying god you're talking about i'm lost you know because even according to jesus the lord our god is one and you say the, the lord our god is one and three and three and one discounted god for everyone let me respond so i'm gonna i'm not gonna pick up i'm not gonna respond on your last last points where you kind of just try to try to prove islam is false ideology again i'm not gonna pick that one we can discuss that another time let me pick up last second point um what was the your last second yeah she forget she's not listening to me exactly she, she ah, yeah yeah sorry 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 actually yes well done guys well remember done. probably i'm having my period today and i'm having are deficient. my deficient uh, women are deficient uh, okay. and sometimes <laughs> we can forget even i forget sorry i'm uh, i bring so, this uh, Actually, actually, it is disappointing to hear the version you are giving to us. Because what happened between Gabriel and Joseph and Mary, yeah. if Joseph needed to keep his mouth shut, this book would not tell us, this book would not tell us Mary was virgin. This book would not tell us what happened so I clearly she was clearly yes she was she's virgin she, she was is, virgin she was virgin, but yes. if joseph needed to keep his mouth shut that means no one would know that mary is virgin but it is in scripture because gabriel did not appear to joseph in the intention keep your mouth shut that wasn't the intention. Read it. Intention is the world is broken, the darkness is taking over the light, and God, out of his love, God the Father loves the world so much, and he gives his son in the intention that the light will overcome the darkness. That's all it is. That's all it is. It is not joseph i am gonna do something dodgy here keep your mouth shut or i will take your life i think you are thinking the story of muhammad <laughs> i don't want to get in that one but it looks like you are thinking about the story of muhammad keep your mouth shut or i will kill your story but that's not the story which bible gives us bible god revealed himself to the people and his revelation to the people in many different ways. And one of them was the true visions and dreams. And Joseph was part of God's big plan. And he has been faithful to God. And he become earthly father, 
not earthly father, a uh, legal, legal father, legal father for God, man, Lord Jesus Christ. Okay. And that's all it is, Yahya. I am sorry, I don't have time to bring up what Muhammad did to the people when yeah. they needed yeah, yeah, yeah. to yeah, well, keep I their mouth shut. That's the first thing. Second thing is, actually, I'm not sure why you are having problem when Lord Jesus Christ steps into this broken world, gives his life on the cross for humanity, and then gives us opportunity for salvation for those who are repented. You are thinking that actually God is breaking in an engagement or in a relationship. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. There are billions, billions people out there. I don't know why God loved me so much and gave his life for me. I look at this brother. He's kind. He's nice. But I really don't know what God saw in him that he gave his son for him. I don't know. As well as I don't know what God saw in Mary, in Virgin Mary, and then asked Virgin Mary to carry God man in her tummy. But all it tells me something. God whom created everything out of his love for God the Son, okay? He created everything. He trusted his son to a virgin for her to carry in her tummy for nine months. God didn't send his son as a king, as a warrior. I am summarizing. Listen carefully. He didn't send his son as a king, as a warrior, as an adult, but he trusted his one and only son to a virgin and then put that son in the tummy of virgin and virgin was responsible to look after my God. Virgin was responsible to feed him, make sure he doesn't have broken feet, make sure he doesn't, have, he doesn't cry at night, make sure he sleeps well. It just tells me God loves me so much that he trusted his one and only son to a child. He didn't send his son to King Hezekiah. He didn't send his son Herod, Herod, to Herod. Or Herod, but Hezekiah, like Hezekiah, Hezekiah was one of, uh, one of the good prophets. He didn't send his son to Isaiah in the time of Isaiah. He chose to use Mary and he trusted that woman to look after God man. And today, that God trusted me to tell you one day before it is too late, Yahya, you will bow down and tell that Jesus Christ is Lord. There is no any other option for you. One day you have to, you are going to say that. But God puts me here today, I don't know why. God puts me here today and then says, if you don't repent today, if you don't repent before you die, on the day of judgment, you will be bowing down to Lord Jesus Christ unwillingly. And that's going to be horrible because I know where is my place. My place is where Jesus is. And as he died and he resurrected on the third day, and according to John chapter 1, he came from the bosom of the Father, that is my place. He offers me place in the bosom of the Father where he is. Versus, that offer is up to you as well. But if you today reject and feel sorry for Joseph, feel sorry for Joseph's engagement, it's not going to take you anywhere. May I respond? That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that was a wrap up from you, wrap up from us. Can you, can you please give up Muhammad? Yeah, can Islam, you uh, please uh, give up the Quran? <laughs> can you please identify Lord Jesus Christ as your Lord and as your Savior? I am afraid and my heart is breaking because I know heart of my God breaks. 
you are going to end up in hell and it's going to be a very terrible place for you. I would say only one thing. I would say only one thing. We will have a lot of discussion in the next weeks. Uh, I invite you to the Father of Jesus, John 17, 3, the only true God, and whom Jesus say that he is his Father and he is his God. So Jesus is that not the Father and not, not the, the Son at the same time. Because Jesus, another butchering of the Christian Jesus, scripture. Uh, Jesus, I told you, I didn't if, interrupt. I told you, if you butcher my scripture, I, I will step in. I didn't and interrupt. And can you please show me your sorry face for butchering my scripture? I didn't interrupt. Let me finish. <laughs> Let me finish. Uh, Jesus teach us. Uh, Jesus teach us. The Father is greater than the Son. So the Son is not as equal as the Father. And Jesus teach us that the Father is the only true God. John 17, 3. Stop uh, bullshitting yourself and de deceiving yourself. I, you, you, you help me well. You are deceiving yourself. You are, and you are the one who are going to bow down and help fire. And I will bow down next to Jesus, yeah, yeah. to the true, only true God, who is Allah. Yahweh. Allah, Yahweh, Yahweh. 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 he yeah. never called Jesus, he never called Yahweh. He called him Allah, Ilahi, Allah. <laughs> yeah, go, so now, go and as, read, go as, go as Yahweh read. changes the topic, yeah, no, no, all we don't start again, no, he don't start topic. again, he don't start topic. again. Yeah, I'm not going to start, start again, again. Yahweh, I finish with you, but I just wanted to identify on your conclusion statement, all you did was changing the topic. Yeah, yeah. So let me finish. The topic is that Jesus is no God. Let me and finish. Never is. Let me finish Jesus with, the, with the word of Jesus. Messiah. I'm going to finish Christ, with the word of Jesus. The prophet and of the Jews. Especially Jew. with the passage you picked, Yahya. Okay? Listen very carefully. Oh, you, you listen, you listen. Father. Your the time has come. Bible. Glorify your son, that your son may glorify you. What the glorification For you granted you're him about the authority over all people, the cross. that he might give uh, eternal kind of life to all those who guys? have given him. Uh, wake not up. this eternal. Not this is eternal. Not this is eternal it's life. Not the that glory. they it's may a humiliating death on curse. Jesus, your God, is cursed on the cross. Anyone who is, of Jesus who is die on his the cross death and his the, resurrection. Yes, that is that's right. correct. That's it. That's it. That's listen, no, listen to me. this is eternal life. Listen to me. That they may know you, the yes, only, the only true, true God, God and Jesus Christ, Je whom you have sent. Yeah, I messenger. have brought you glory on earth by completing the work you have given me to do. And now, Father, mercy on your glorify fault. me in your presence with the glory I had with you before the world may God, began. May God Father, have mercy on you. I want those you have given to me be with me where I am and to see my glory. The glory with you had given me because you loved me before the creation of the world. Yeah. May God have mercy That's on you. That's the God That's we May, may wanted God have mercy on you. That is may the God, God have mercy who is you. full in love with us. That is the God who offers place may, in the bosom of the may, Father for may us. May God have See mercy on you. May yeah, God have mercy on you. A glory Mr. or b brutal humiliation, curse, death. Thank you, Mr. Big. Thank you, guys. Thank you.